Hey everyone, it is Sparkle and welcome back to my channel. In this video, this was highly requested. I've had a few people ask me to do a floor arrangement. So I will take you step by step on how I create my floor arrangements. And I found this bowl from Ross. It was only $7.99. So that's what I'm going to use for my vase. And you'll also need some floral foam. That's what you see me using here. Um, I purchased this from Hobby Lobby. So I just wanted to make sure that it fits and it does. So I'm just gonna add some glue. And the glue is also from Hobby Lobby and also the glue gun is from Hobby Lobby. But I'm using that to put on the foam so that way it'll stick to the bowl. And when I put my florals in there, it won't move so that's what the floral foam is for now you don't have to use glue if you don't want to you don't have to but i chose to use glue just to secure it more now as far as the floral foam um it does come in different shapes they do have the round and then they have the rectangular shapes and that's the one i'm using the rectangular um but either one it doesn't matter you would just have to cut it to um, the shape that you need so it, it, it doesn't matter but that's what I'm doing just cutting out little blocks and just filling filling it in around the bowl now the next step is I'm going to add some Spanish moss on top of the foam and what I like to do I like to put some glue on top of the foam and then just kind of pat my um, Spanish moss on the top so that way it could secure it just a little bit so that's what I like to do like I said you don't have to do this but this is what I like to do and then you're not going to see the foam at the bottom so I will be putting some on the sides just to fill in those gaps next i have some floor wire it's a green color because i want it to blend in with the spanish moss and what i like to do is i just cut them up into five or four pieces and I use them, I kind of shape them like a bobby pin just to pin down the Spanish moss, just like that. So that was secured even more. And then it's green, so it'll blend in with the Spanish moss. And you can see that I'm taking each piece of wire and folding it over and pinning it down into the floral foam. Just adding some more glue and I will be adding more Spanish moss. So you just wanna make sure that you fill in all those empty spaces before you put your florals in there. So I'm just gonna do that all the way around just until I feel like it's full enough and you won't be able to see the foam at the bottom. For this floor arrangement, I will be using orchids and I have these bamboo stakes that I'll be using. So anything that I have links to will be in the description box. So I'm going to use these stakes to hold up my orchids. And I'm just going to cut the stem just a little bit. And these are some really long orchids i think these are 37 to 38 inches tall so they are really long and it's full and i'm going to add a little glue now i'm going to tie the orchid and the bamboo stake together and what i'm using now a lot of people use different things i've seen people use zippy ties you can use any kind of string. Um, this that I'm using is twine. It's a roll. Um, I got it from, I think it was Walmart. 
I think that's what it was. But what I'm gonna do with mine, I did tie it and I'm just gonna add some glue and wrap it around. But like I said, you can do it any way you want. Now I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna add another orchid, but this one is just gonna be a little bit shorter. So I'm doing the same method that I did with the first one. All right, so I got the orchids in. Now I'm gonna add the orchid leaf and I'm gonna add some glue to that. So to make my arrangement look a little realistic, just a little bit more realistic, I wanna add some grass. Of course, it's artificial. This is from Hobby Lobby, so I cut a piece of that off and I'm gonna put some glue on it and place it inside the vase. I'm gonna add some white lilies to this arrangement. These are from Michael's. This bowl that I'm using, it is, um, it's kind of lightweight. It's not heavy at all. So I did make sure that I purchased two of them this size and I did get the two smaller size one. It's been a couple months, but the smaller ones were $5.99 and this size was $7.99. So that was, that was a steal. And when I saw it, I said, okay, I know I can put some florals in here. So you can put florals in any type of dish, any type of dish and turn it into a vase and make a beautiful arrangement. So that's another thing that you can do um, if you don't wanna spend a lot of money on an actual vase. Run to Dollar Tree, run to Walmart, go on their kitchen aisle, Go to Ross, go in their kitchen aisle, and find you a bowl that you like.
So with this arrangement, I didn't want it to be super full. I didn't want it to be too full at all, especially not for this, um, the bowl that I'm using. So I'm just gonna add a few more pieces of greenery and then we'll get an overall look and you'll see how it turned out. <music> 